This planet is filled with bad choices. I just don't blame time and I don't blame my kids. I have never said I don't have enough time and I never said, oh, I can't do it because of the kids. I wake up in the morning early, okay? I try to say yes to everything that's productive. If I say yes to the things that are productive, I have no time for weeks. I don't end up doing things that are destructive when I'm busy doing things that are constructive. The truth is I was never a drug addict. I just had too much free time and made bad choices. This planet is filled with bad choices. Pornography, strip joints, casinos. If you were filled up all day long with activities, if you were addicted to productivity, if you were junkied out on potential, you wouldn't have time for all the other garbage. I, would, I, wouldn't be, I wouldn't spend money on stuff I don't need. When is that money spent? When do we waste most of our money on this planet? During the holidays, when we have free time. When do you spend your money? When do you go in debt? On the holidays, free time. So if I can just stay busy, if I can use time and create time, how do I create time? I have 24 hours and I'm like, I'm gonna jam as much in those 24 hours as I can and then I'll let you worry about me burning out because that's what I'll hear next. What about burnout? When you, you're going to burn out? Look, I'm 60 years old. The more I do, the more I can do, and the younger I get. The more I do, the younger I feel. The more I do, the younger my body feels. I'm not going to burn out. I'm not a candle. I'm not wax. The, the, the counselor back in, 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 uh, in uh, the, the, the treatment center said to me, dude, aren't you worried about, because he, he's seen my success now, and he's like, aren't you worried about burning out? I'm like, dude, you're the burnout, bro. You're the burnout. You're the one that said I was going to come back. You're the one that said I would never make it. You're the one that said uh, uh, don't write books. I've written seven of them, man, okay? You're the one that said don't be a star. I am. I have my own TV studio, right? You're the one that said, Grant, don't get rich. Just be satisfied that you don't use drugs again. No, no, I got rich, okay? I did the rich. I did the books. I did the TV. I'm going to be on a billboard. I'm going to be on a bus, bro. Look, look, what are you doing? I'm not worried about burnout. I am not a candle. Candles burn out. Spiritual beings don't. So, so human beings, human beings are trapped in, as spiritual beings, they're trapped. I, this is what I believe. I believe. I believe the spiritual being is trapped in a body. Okay? I believe I'm a spiritual being, not a human being. The spiritual being would have tremendous potential, unbelievable potential. It would be the light on the candle, not the candle. The body would be the candle. Okay? And, and the spiritual being would be the flame. I, I'm not, I'm, I'm the flame. And, and I want to see how hot can I burn? Okay, how far can I go? How much light can I bring the world? How much positive truth message can I bring this planet? How much more can I do? And I think the problem is people are settling out with just enough. Pay the bills, take care of my family, get my little box, get my little house, Put my little welcome mat on the front. Put the little gate around the yard. We're all gonna be happy. I don't want the box. I don't want one location. I don't need the welcome mat. I wanna know the world. I wanna travel the world. I wanna do more. I wanna be in more places. I wanna have friends in every country. I wanna inspire people in every language. And I want other people to see and they can do the same thing, you know? And, and, and maybe, maybe, maybe at the end of all this, I just become everybody's uncle that I never had. Thank <laughs> you.